G'day, welcome to the Tech Math Channel. I'm Josh. Can you solve this problem? Pause this video if you'd like to give this problem a try, and then when you're ready to see how to solve it, come back and I'll show you how to do it. So time's up, how did you go? Let me know your answer in the comments and then come back and see how you went. All right, so let's go through this. So first off, what we have is we have three clocks that add up to 21. We have the three calculators that add up to 30. We have the three light bulbs where we add one and then take it away, and this is equal to 15. And then we have this equation down here where we add the clock to the calculator, and then we multiply it by the number of light bulbs. So there's a couple of parts to this. So first off, what we're going to work out is we're going to work out what the clocks are worth here. So if we go and have a look at the clocks here, we have a time of nine o'clock. On this clock, we have a time of nine o'clock. And on this clock, we have a time of three o'clock. Nine plus nine plus three, is equal to 21. So when we go down to here, what we're really looking at is what time is it on the clock, and that will give us our number. We're looking at nine o'clock, so this number down here is a nine. So the next part of this problem, we are going to be looking at the calculators. Now you're going to notice with these calculators that they have numbers on them, one, two, three, four. This amount plus this amount plus this amount is equal to 30. Now what you're going to see, if you add one plus two plus three plus four, that this is equal to 10. So this is also one, two, three, four, that's equal to 10. This is also one, two, three, four, that's equal to 10. 10 plus 10 plus 10 is equal to 30. If we have a look at the calculator down here, you'll see that we have a one, a two, a two, and a four, it's a bit different. So one plus two plus two plus four, this calculator gives us a value of nine. The next step is we have to look at these light bulbs. This has a couple of parts to it. If we were to get one of these light bulbs, we add it on and then we take it away, we get 15. So first off, what we can do is we can cancel these two light bulbs out. We add something on, then we take it away, it cancels out. The next thing, if we have a look at this last bit of the equation here, you're going to notice that we have one, two, three, four bits of light coming off the light bulb. But here, you'll notice that we have one, two, three, four, five. So this gives us a bit of a clue of what we should be working out. We're saying that each one of these bits of light has a certain value, and there are five of them. So there's one, two, three, four, five. If we go 15 divided by five, we get that each one of these bits of light coming off has a value of three. So let's take that down here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, bits of light coming off, and each one has a value of three. 12 times three, we have the answer of 36. So now we have this equation which is ready to be solved. We have nine plus nine times 36. Now when we do this, we are going to have to do order of operations. So watch out for this. The very first thing we're going to do is we're going to work out nine times 36. We do this first in order of operation, so let's do this first. Nine times 36 is going to be 324. And to that, we're going to be getting nine and adding that to that. Finally, we'll get our last part of our answer, which is nine plus 324. Our answer is 333. And that is the correct answer. That is how you solve this particular problem. How did you go with that? Did you get the right answer? Let me know in the comments what you thought of that. I know it's been making the rounds for a little while, but it kept coming into my inbox and I thought I might solve it. Anyway, thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.